from Sweetheart's Hair Design and today I'm going to show you the four strand French braid which is a little bit more interesting than just keeping on doing the three strand French braid. So I'm here with my daughter Abby who wants me to tell you that she's now six and not five so very grown up. So you're going to say hi Abs. Hi. Good girl. Okay let's get started. To start the braid you want to take a section of hair at the top of the head. So I've kept her parting and I'm using the side of the head that's got most of the hair on. And I'm just going to take a section of hair and divide it into four. So once you've got your four sections, you're going to start on the left hand side and you're going to take this section over and then you're going to take it under this section. So that's your first stitch. Now you're going to start from the top, so you've got your four pieces again. This time you're going to go under first, and then you're going to go over. And you're going to repeat that all the way down, but adding in hair from now on in. So, we're going to take a small section of hair, add it into that left hand section, you're going to go over and then you're going to go under that one so now you're back to the top so this time you're going to take a small section of hair add it into that section and you're going to go under this one and over that one So when you get to the bottom and you've still got your four strands, take this one underneath and you're still just repeating that process. So this one goes over that one and this strand has never add, had the hair added in all the way down which is why it's thinner. So you will run out of hair with this strand so when you do just tie an elastic. Now I think the braid looks pretty like that and certainly very smart for school. It's one I do a lot for school other than a normal French braid. What you can do as well is the bit that's the right hand side, which actually is the Dutch side of it because you've gone under all the way. You can just go back very gently and just take these sections and just give them a little bit of a pull. And just fatten them up a little bit. and do that all the way down the braid. So that's the four strand French braid finished. It's a little bit different than just doing your normal French braid. So I hope you like it and enjoyed watching the video. And if you did, please subscribe to Sweetheart's Hair Design. And I'm also on Instagram at Sweetheart's Hair Design. Thank you, bye.